Now, Halfron has come a long way since we entered the Stuart Turner competition at the Thames Traditional Boat Festival last year. Since then, a whole lot of work has been done, including a few minor repairs. All the wood has been sanded back and lavished with at least eight layers of varnish. It was so much work, in fact, that I handed the job to my mates Mark and Hannah of Tiller and Keel. And haven't they done a wonderful job? Mark even swapped the nasty plywood top decks for this beautiful striped oak, which is far more sophisticated. Also, Hannah blasted off all of the old grey paint and waxed the wood so the deck boards now look fantastic and much more in keeping with the rest of the boat. As you can see, all the brass is now polished too and we've replaced any of the missing hooks that hold on the protective cover. In fact, the waterline has also been corrected and the anti-foul has been replaced as well. It's all looking tip-top and Bristol fashion, so I'm now turning my attention to the engine and just cleaning and preserving a few little areas with some AC90. After all, I don't want the mechanical bits to let the side down. Thinking about it, Hafra might even now be good enough to win the next competition. Just one thing left to sort out, the name. You know, it's amazing that in the last H&H classic auction, the Chitty replica went for £175,000. And that reminds me, it's been a while since we had Bid of the Week. And this is a particularly special bid, as it's a very special auction. On September the 20th at Duxford Aerodrome, H&H will be celebrating their 30th anniversary to the day. So we thought it might be fun to auction off little Hafren. OK, it's a boat, but it will fit in very nicely with all of those lovely classic cars. There is also the fast road sale and registration numbers as well. And there's even a share in a seaplane going up for grabs. So you better get yourselves down to the Imperial War Museum at Duxford for viewing on Tuesday the 19th of September. And the bidding starts at 10am on Wednesday the 20th. And Hafron is lot two.